Hello and happy gaming, everyone. <clears throat> Welcome back to Dark Sage Walker Plays Dicey Dungeons. That's right, birds. That's right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so I've been recording for exactly 15 seconds. You have to go nuts already? Okay, I'm thinking about trying something new when I go to start recording. I'm thinking I might need to move my bird's cage, like, over here, like, next to me. So that way she doesn't feel like she's being left out of anything. Anyway, so, this is starting to become a bit of a, a bit of a running gag, but... Last episode I said, Thief, episode 6, hard mode, we're gonna do it. I changed my mind one more time. I actually want to see what this is. So, let's go, let's go have a run at Lady Luck. Well, hello, my doomed little dicelings. Oh, no. Oh, yes. Now, what are you doing backstage? Ready to give up on your dreams and go into minion training? We're leaving. You can't stop us. You totally can, sorry. Yeah, I definitely can. Or haven't you been paying attention? We've been paying a lot of attention. We've fought through your dungeons. We've beaten your bosses. And yet we're still trapped down here thanks to your rigged wheel of lies. You're a cheat and this game isn't fair, so we're going home. Minions, the doors, enter lockdown. Once the doors are locked, that's it. We're stuck backstage until we give up. I'm real sorry, friends, but at least we tried. No, I'm not giving up. And I'm not going to stay backstage forever. Quick, can anyone make it through the last door before it closes? Oh, I get my ch I get my shot, huh? Final showdown. So since I get to pick who I want to use, so I might have to do this a few times, but let's try it with the robot. Okay, okay, I can do this. You'll be okay, just wait for me. Keep calm, remember those breathing exercises I taught you. You're a robot. Ah, it's all down to me, what do I do, what do I do? Breathe in, two, three, four. Hold, two, three, four. Out, two, three, four. If the robot is knocked out, it's game over. Okay. Hi. I guess my roommate's dog also decided they wanted to pop up and say hello. The enemy joins your party. Welcome. Great, you're going up against Lady Luck? You? You've barely been here five minutes. What have you got to complain about? I've been asking for better equipment for years and nothing. Now you think you're the one who's being wronged? I'll show you. You're the little frog, bitch. You don't, you don't know nothing. Roll four even dice. Okay, why not? What? What? Hey, um, if you do manage to beat Lady Luck, could you ask if I can get that sword upgrade I've been asking for? I could... I could come with you if that would help. Okay, this is a very strange round. Oh. 
Oh, okay, I think I understand now. Alright, so there's a good chance I'm losing the frog here. This is interesting. All right, so seems like the seems like the best way to do this is to switch fighters. Is to switch fighters often. Kind of depends on what you roll. Three, two. All right, so. <laughs> A lot of my choices are going to be based entirely on what, huh? on what, uh, what I roll. And I'm not going to be too sad if I end up losing a weaker, a weaker companion. Needs a six. You're taking a while to bring down, just because you just aren't doing much. Well, I'm not doing much, has nothing to do. No, oh, there's no way to go back after you've chosen to try to select a fighter, huh? Alright. So Robobot goes down. Wow. Alright, that's an, that's an interesting way to make things work. Alright, so I'm probably going to have to do this a couple of times while I'm kind of coming to grips with it. Thank you. Hey, an equipment upgrade. Nice. Fireman is weak to ice. I don't think I have any ice to use. On the other hand, I can switch to Stereo Head and drop some weaken on you. It would be nice if I can get more than two dice, like, ever. But this is obviously supposed to be a little bit more difficult than uh, than normal. Whoa. 
Look, I know we're enemies, but I've always admired your fight. Can I ask a favor? If you run into the snowman, can you give him a message for me? Or, you know what, never mind, I'm coming with you. Yeah, why not? Taking on Lady Luck? All of you? Together? Huh. Here, take this, it might help. Can't say I blame you minions for joining in. Working conditions have been going downhill lately. Why not shake things up a bit? The third die will help a huge amount. Two, two, five. Alright, so I don't have a lot of hope of saving Stereo Head, so let's get a couple of Weaken out of him now. Now let's switch to Fireman and light things up a little. That was a terrible pun! Yes, it was. Okay, I'm not too sad about taking three damage. Probably should have just let Poison do the job. Mr. King Rat and Rhino Beetle. I think Rhino Beetle is going to be a choice number one. One, four, six. Alright, so I've got. Okay, I don't know what I'm going to do with that. Go Fireman. That's an awful lot of damage to take. I don't know who in the world could possibly make use of two ones effectively. Hi. 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 Hello. How are you? There we go. One oh, Jesus. Getting just garbage. Garbage, I tell you. Also, it doesn't help that the fighters I'm getting aren't so great. Kind of didn't mean to do that, but that's fine. Hello, Rhino Beetle. Let me get this straight. You're trying to leave the dungeons, and you've got the minions to help you. You might want this. Thank you, Val. Don't tell anyone I gave it to you without a trade. Alright, so robot's okay, so let's heal up Mr. Cactus. This is something I'm gonna want to do with each of the fighters just because it's fun.
Well, you know we've got to, you know we've got to become dry. Actually, she's strong in poison. Probably not for the whole fight, though. But yo, birds, calm it. Okay, there. He's not getting all the poison. Alright, so who else do I have to work with? Let's switch it over to Cactus. We're gonna go Cactus Shield, Cactus Shield. And stick you with a hand, stick you with a pokey. And I guess we're moving on. He is also strong against poison, so I'm not expecting to make it very far here. Oh, come on. You suck. By that, I mean I simply don't appreciate the way that you're treating me. Simply because you can shrug off a lot of poison damage and self recovery is big. Okay, less than five, please. There we go. Who knew that Dryad was going to be one of the ones that lasted the longest here? I think honestly because, because she's been doing so well... Heal her and move on. I can get Singer to fight for me, huh? Alright. So, I don't want to put Dryad in just yet. Who else do I have? Is there a way to check? I keep forgetting who all I have. I know I've got Dryad, Cactus, Rhino Beetle. Ooh, Rhino Beetle. Hold on. Use that battle axe, boy! Give her hell! Why'd I say it like that? Okay, so in your weakened state, let's switch you over to... See, Rat King can take a hit, which is nice. Let's not put you in. I think Rat King. If only I could switch one more time. But yeah, he's about to get just slapped.
now let's switch it over to Dryad, who's been very solid. And next turn, I really don't have to do anything. An ability to recover some health would be good, but that's all she really needs. Yeah, there you go. Oh, but she's weakened, of course. Why are you all walking around together, anyway? Are you going on a road trip? Can I come? I love songs about road trips. I'll bring my guitar, and we can sing as we walk. Okay, so she's a little dumb. Alright. Now let's take on Audrey. Okay, so I don't have great rolls here. Like, to the point where I don't think any of my any of my companions would be doing any better. Well, yeah, five damage, yay. This is gonna take a while. Two, four, three, five. Go singer. Still does a lot of damage, good lord. Should switch, but I have no idea to who. Probably Cactus, just... Yeah, it's a shame, but it was to be expected. Start dropping some poison on her. And is there anyone else that can make better use of a 3 and a 1? Let's have a look. Why, yes, there is. Now you can still knock her out, and that's a damn shame. So once again, we'll start here, the whole idea being that we can drop a bunch of poison on you and do a lot of damage. Right, now we can switch, and we'll switch to Dryad. drop even more poison on you. I really don't have to do anything here. I would love to be able to recover, but I don't think I'll be able to. So now we've got three heals coming. We use one for Mr. Robot. We use one for Dryad. 
And one for Rat King. Alright, I think this is as good as it gets. Let's move on. Lady Elec changes equipment every turn. Alright, 200? Oh, good lord. Well, I thought I'd trapped you for eternity, but I see you've been running around the dungeons yet again. I've come to get my friends. And you've made some new ones? Yeah, when I told them I was going to take you down, they were all ready, they were all really keen to join in. You're not super popular around here, you know. Oh my dear. I don't need popularity. I have power, as you are about to find out. Five, nine, ten, so that's not going to be quite enough to use Dryad's Poison Slingshot. Alright, so how do I want to do this? I think what I want to do is actually switch to Rhino Beetle and just get a good head start in on things. Five freaking dice, and they're all sixes. Let's start laying poison. Start here. There we go. Alright. I knew that. Okay, so she just gets weird-ass equipment. Like a serious WTF there. equipment do you get this time? So I'm not exactly sure how this is even a possibility. But we're getting we're getting a lot done regardless. Switch one more time. <laughs> you don't like my rules? Well, bad luck, because it's time for some more. More rules for everyone. Don't use fives, huh? Alright. You don't have a self-recovery option, so I might as well. I don't really have anyone that can use four ones effectively.
Might have to do this a second time. Shock all equipment, okay. Don't use threes. I can't afford to lose 10 health, so I guess that's it. Reduce health to one. All right, so her second grouping of equipment... Look at that. Well, look at that. You're still just about alive. And I know how hard you worked to get this far. It almost seems a shame to end it all. Oh, wait, no, it doesn't. In fact, it seems long overdue and very satisfying to me personally. And poison should end this. No! Impossible! Well, thank you, Audrey. You were a big help. Oh, no, no, no. And amazing. Defeat Lady Luck. You found us! You did it! And you brought the minions! You didn't give up! I'm so happy to see you! Wait, confetti? What's happening? And why are those lights flashing? Mm. Because you won, you big silly billy! You refused to abandon your friends! You put aside your differences with the minions! And you gave up your worldly desires and beat me! And you're... You're not angry? Mm. Oh my dear, no, of course not. You've done brilliantly. Gosh, when was the last time we had a real live victory? Aww. Jester, darling, can you fetch the records? No, I'm not your minion anymore. We don't have any records anyway. Oh, are you sure? Tiny pink octopus, go and see if you can find any records. I've been waiting so long for someone to actually win this game you wouldn't believe. I feel like it would have happened sooner if you hadn't made the game so hard and didn't cheat. But then, what would have happened to your journey of self-realization? Now, everyone pose for a photo. Beautiful! Such a magnificent little bundle of fighters. Come on, one more. I want something to remember you by when you're gone. When we're gone? So, we're free to go? All of us? Of course. But I don't get to be super strong? No. And I don't get my followers? No, your prize is self-knowledge, darling. I thought we covered that. Also, I can't help but notice that I'm still a giant walking dice. Yes, and? Is there some sort of problem? No, one more big s- <laughs> Yay, you don't get your original forms back. Fuck it. One more big smile. Say cheese! Okay, look. I can deal with having to sleep. And I've kind of gotten used to the dice thing. But what about the minions? Are they free to go as well? Yeah, we would never have made it without them. Honestly, my loves, they're all very settled here. They might grumble a little, but they have families and vegetable gardens and everything. That's not the point! They fought with us! And they won! I suppose you're right. They were very brave. I'll tell you what, they can leave if they really want to. And if they don't, then I'll see if that employee suggestion box opens. I might increase everyone's holiday leave. What holiday leave? From nothing, my dear. I'll increase it from nothing. My goodness, can't you just enjoy your confetti? Oh, jeez. Okay, I guess it's pretty good confetti. No, let's all, let's all give one last big smile and think about the lessons we've learned as we fought so valiantly in these dungeons. In some cases, we fought side by side, and maybe in other cases, we fought in vicious opposition, but the important thing is that we did it together. Ah, my precious little dice keeters. My real live winners. It's been such a delight having you here. Please, please do drop by any time. I absolutely promise I'll let you leave again. Now, did we ever make any end credits? Apparently, yes. Yes, end credits were made. 
All right, so that was actually a very interesting episode. I quite enjoyed that. I'm not 100% sure if I'm going to actually go through it with everyone, because I'm not sure what would change. My guess is not much. But, it would be interesting to actually use some of these, some of these abilities. Like, being able to actually, actually play as Aoife would be a lot of fun. Getting to use the bear transformation as the alchemist would be fun. But yeah, I definitely see, I definitely see that one being pretty difficult. All right then. So now what changes? We defeated Lady no Lady Lux, and now I'm just having fun, having fun and staying hydrated, fighting monsters in an amazing workout. Hold on. Yes, I probably could just grab the whole scroll thing, but the hell with it. Baby squid! Favorite food? Shrimp! Greatest fear, being left alone down here forever. Happiest moment, when the dice came back to fight again. That was so nice of them. Reasons for entering... Wanted to be a great big giant squid, not just a little baby squid. It's a very simple reason to enter the dungeons. So what do the others change to? You know, I might not have a billion dollars, but if I find enough of those solid gold coins, they'll be worth a whole lot in the outside world. Got a point. Returning to the dungeons is a great way to spend time with my friends and keep myself sharp. I even brought some thoughtful gifts for the monsters. Now that we're not all distracted by trying to escape, maybe I'll finally be able to figure out how this place works. Oh, little inventor. The witch. Hey friends, turns out you love my Dicey Dungeons video, so I'm back for more. Hope you like them. Just don't forget to watch my non-dungeon content as well. Heh, <laughs> fun. I'm glad I can leave now, but I lived in the dungeons for hundreds of years. You can't blame me for getting homesick sometimes. And then you could just go do that again. Alright, interesting. Well, I think that's gonna do it for now. That was actually a lot of fun, and... The idea of running it with the other characters, while not necessary, could actually just be really cathartic and fun. So, that having been said, I hope you liked what you saw. Subscribe to the channel, there's more coming down the pipeline, and, I'll be, and I will be back with more content. I might even start playing other games, what about that? Haha! <laughs> Until next time, this is Dark Sage Walker, and I'll be seeing you.